Hello, this is Trisha from Sandy and Auto, and today I have a special themed haul for you today. This is all going to be the False Graph Brown Drip Glaze Pottery. I have a fantastic collection of this extremely popular uh, pattern and it is really spectacular. Um, I believe this was originally from the 70s, um, looks it, <laughs> and it is just a, an amazing, amazing pattern. Now, I don't just have dishware, I've got a couple really spectacular pieces. You'll want to stick to the end to see those. Now, these will start being incorporated into my live sales, which are every Wednesday at 4 p.m. Eastern and Saturday night at 10 p.m. Eastern time. Um, but they all also will be available um, before that. So if you are interested in a piece, you can either leave a comment in the description or um, you can email me. My email is in the description also. And if you are new to my channel, please subscribe and click that notification bell so you'll be notified when I go live for my sales and when I put out new content like this. And uh, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Okay, let's get into it. I'm gonna start with four dinner plates. Um, these are, these might be the only ones that do actually say false graph on them, but look at this glaze. This is so cool. No two are alike. Ooh, I can see the sunlight is washing me out a bit, <laughs> but not the items. I'll hold them on this side so you can get a good view of them. Here is the back mark that does say false graph. And I'll show you how each one is different. Oh, I love this one. Isn't that pretty? Kind of looks like a sunflower. And then here is the third one. Each one is truly unique and its own work of art. And then here is the fourth one. Again, different, but the same pattern. Oh, I love those. So there are four of these dinner plates and these are, I'll measure them real quick. They are the 10 inch plates. Here I should get this kind of handy in case I need to measure more. Now I'm going to move on to this. Oh, look at this. This is a serving bowl. Oh, so good. Great for salads and pastas. And again, that incredible drip glaze. So good on this. And then it does go a little bit onto the rim around. But each one of these unique and hand done. And this is it's about 13 inches across and it's about four inches deep, three and a half, four inches deep. So cool. I just love that glaze. Here is the next piece, which is a pitcher which I have to say looks really cool sitting in that little bowl. I'll show you. I'll show you how great this looks together. Oh, so good. But here is the pitcher. And again, oh, such a beautiful drip glaze on this thing. And this one might have a little bit. It's really hard on some of these to see that false graph mark. And this picture, it, it's a serious picture. It is about 10 inches tall. And look at that drip glaze on the handle and all down the spout. Oh, this is so good. 
Okay, the next piece I'm going to show is a two-tier serving tray. And again, very unique drip glaze. Now this, I'm going to measure to see if it is, um, it is the same 10 inches. So 10 inches on this one. So probably a dinner plate, um, even though it doesn't have the same markings on the bottom. Similar, but not quite the same. But oh, such a beautiful glaze on these two pieces. Love that. Okay. Now on to the super fun pieces. So again, four dinner plates, the bowl. So we've got the four dinner plates, oops, the bowl and pitcher, the two tier serving tray, and two more pieces. I'm gonna start with, I'll start with this one. This is a planter and a donkey. How amazing is that donkey? And he's got the little poof of hair on top that is beautifully glazed. And he's got his little opening and little side saddles there. Cute little tail. Now this is a serious planter. I will say he is big. So he is about 10 inches tall and about 10 inches across. And the planter opening is almost four inches. So he again is 10 by 10. He is so cool. Here is the bottom and the back and then the inside again with that beautiful drip glaze coming down into the inside a bit. And then on the back where his little hair is, the mane, <laughs> and just such fun little details on him. And then his fantastic face. His front leg is crossed there. Back legs are straight. Front leg is crossed in the front. Oh, he is so good. And next and last is the hen on nest. How amazing is this piece? Oh, look at that drip glaze on the top and around the rim. And, oh, I got to put it down <laughs> because it is big. So let me get a measurement across here. And yeah, I'm going to say about 10 and a half inches across. And it sits about eight inches tall. So we'll see. We'll put it up against here. <laughs> and you can see this is a serious hen on nest. Now I will take the top off here and get a closer look at that beautiful face and the gorgeous glaze. And then you can see throughout there's so much detail with the glaze, a little bit of feather detail. Here is the inside, and this is just glaze, just how the glaze is on there. And it probably, I will say it's glazed over, so it came with that little bit of a dark spot there, but oh, so good. And I'll show the base. Again, we've got like a basket weave on the bottom. And then that beautiful drip 
around the rim. And you can see a little bit goes on the inside also. But again, this is, again, not knowing how big my head is, but it's bigger than my head. <laughs> this is a serious hen on nest. So cool. So here is the lid again. Get that right on top there. And, oh, this is so beautiful. So again, this is the false graph um, brown drip glaze collection. These are fantastic pieces. I was really happy to find them um, and get this whole collection. It's amazing. So again, these items will start being incorporated into my sales. But if you know anyone who is a fan of um, brown drip glaze, please share this video with them so they have an opportunity to see this amazing collection and again if you are interested in any of these pieces you can either leave a comment down below or you can email me directly and my email is in the description and thank you for watching and don't forget to give this video a thumbs up subscribe uh, comment and share <laughs> all those good things and uh, i will see you next time